Hello, welcome to the Ingleside Public Library's Virtual Sleep Tight Storytime. Tonight's book will be Something is Not Quite Right by Ralph Butchko. Now, this is a little different. Um, between each page, you can pause it and um, look to see for the mistakes. This is a find the mistake picture book. So as the page is going, I will let you know how many mistakes are in the book or in the pages. And you can pause it from there when I finish reading and have fun. Okay, let's begin. Today is a day just like any other day, Lisa says. Good morning to her dog, Popcorn, and her cat, Butter, as she gets dressed. There's none in here. This is just the first, the first of it. So, any day, every day, or today is the second of your day. But, just as Lisa is about to leave her room, she has a feeling that something is different. Something's not quite right, she says. Hmm. All right, you ready? I will scan the page and there'll be another screen showing the full page of this. That would be a little bit easier. All right, let's begin. What could it be? What is different? Did she give her teddy bear his good morning kiss? Yes, just as she does every morning. So that's not it. Now, in After breakfast, Lisa and Popcorn go out to do some shopping. On the way, they walk past their favorite playground, but Lisa doesn't feel like playing today. She has some important things thinking to do. She must figure out what it is that's not quite right. Did I remember to put on my underpants? Hmm, she asked herself. No, that's not it. I would have noticed that. Maybe I put on two pairs by mistake. Lisa is thinking hard that she doesn't notice the light changed and misses her turn to cross the street. You having fun yet? Finally, Lisa and Popcorn reach the supermarket. Lisa's mom has given her a list of what to buy, vegetables, butter, and cornflakes. For some reason, it takes Lisa much longer than usual to find everything. Hmm.
On most days, Lisa stops at the building site to watch the workers, but today she doesn't feel like it. Something is just not right, she thinks to herself. I wish I could put my finger on what it is. Is it mom's birthday today? Did I forget to buy her a present? No, it can't be, Lisa thinks. Mom's birthday is in winter when it's cold outside. Harbor, Lisa doesn't even stop to throw pebbles into the water like she normally does. Maybe I forgot to feed my fish this morning, she mumbles, but no. As usual, Lisa fed them. In the evening, when she's brushing her teeth, Lisa still wonders what it is that it has been different all day. Maybe she just got up on the wrong side of the bed. That Now it's time for bed. Lisa takes off her shoes, wiggles her feet, and that's it. She has been wearing two different socks all day. Well, well, Lisa sighs happily. I knew something wasn't quite right. Did you get to find all the mistakes? I hope you did. But if not, here are the answer sheets.